Hey! Yep! Yeah. The NBA draft lottery was Tuesday night. That's right. A bunch of teams, including our Knicks, were hoping to land the number one pick and get Zion. As you probably know by now, the New Orleans Pelicans, who shouldn't even be a franchise, got the first pick, while the Knicks ended up at number three. Who's been scared of Pelicans? Pelicans aren't even scared of Pelicans. Whatever. Scary, huh? And the news took Stephen A. Smith to a dark place. Literally. Literal dark. The darkest place ever. He's on the set of Blair Witch Project. Fam. Damn! Damn it! Damn it! <laughs> now, if this, if this was a FaceTime call, you'd be like, nah, get your shit fixed, bro. I'm calling Yo, you back. Stop playing, bro. Get better Wi-Fi, dog. Plug the Ethernet c cable directly into your phone. I know the Knicks had everybody believing that if they got the number one overall pick, they were going to hold on to Zion. But I'm here to tell you, no matter what they tell anybody, they were thinking about moving that pick for Anthony Davis. They were at least thinking about it. He knows he has a show on ESPN, right? Yeah. <laughs> he doesn't have to do this. He don't care. He don't care. Stephen A. Smith was the only one who cared a little too much about the lottery. Yeah. On Tuesday night, we got together with a bunch of Knicks fans and watched the lottery play out in real time. Y'all yeah. want to see a dead body? <laughs> Woo! Okay, all right. Yeah. Oh, yeah, God. Yeah, yeah. Yo, you ready to have this massive panic attack? I haven't been this nervous since I did paternity test with Walt Frazier, bro. Yo. How you feeling? Positive, 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 Why? positive. Why? Positive, Why? Positive. What have the Knicks shown you uh, in all the years you've been a fan that makes you have any hope for tonight? Absolutely nothing. And yet we're still Knicks fans to this day. Hey. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, man. What are we going to do, bro? We're getting number one or we're getting number two. We're getting Zion or we're getting Ja. I said it, and not Ja Rule. Ja Who would Moran. I be moving up, my baby? baby. He can't be on the Knicks because he's going to jail for Fry Fest. That's right. But ironically, he also said love is pain, and that's what being a Knicks fan is all about. Pain. That's beautiful. You know what I'm saying? That's fucking beautiful. If we get the number one pick, I'm going to punch the Empire State Building in his face. That's like, right. I'm, I'm, I'm walling. Yo, let me tell you something. If the Knicks get the number one pick, yes. this is not going to air because I'm going to destroy every piece of equipment in here. That's right. Wild out. Fuck out. You know what would make tonight better? We are like some real New York legends, legends in this building. Like, yeah. Let's go, Zion! Yeah! Let's go! 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 let us go you and with a finger on with this, with that. We need now. It's about to go down, y'all. Y'all ready, oh, Knicks fans? Oh, yeah. 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 that, that. Oh. Ah. Imagine that on the floor of Master Square Garden, dog. Oh. Ah! Oh. Sup? He's a monster. So the time yeah. has come, Zion. The lottery Let's picks go. of the 2019 go. NBA Draft. 14%! Patrick Ewing! Patrick Ewing! Pick number 14 will be made by the Boston Celtics. The ninth pick goes to the Washington Wizards. The seventh pick goes to the Chicago Bulls. Pick number six goes to the Phoenix Suns. Number five, number five, here we go. Here we go. The Cleveland Cavaliers. Patrick Ewan, you're moving on to the next round. Zion, come home! The fourth pick in NBA draft goes go. to the Los Angeles Lakers. The third pick goes to the New York Knicks. Number one pick goes to the New Orleans Pelicans. They fucked up the whole NBA. The whole entire NBA fucked up. What the fuck is a Pelican? Stay right. It's not supposed to be like this. Yo, I'm sorry, I got diabetes. No! No, get the fuck out of here!
Yo, Joe, you always got a word of positivity for us. We need it right now. Yeah. I didn't really want to speak this into existence before the draft started. Did we want Zion? Fuck yeah, we Hell yeah. <laughs> Whatever the case may be, I truly believe this is going to be the yeah. best recruiting year for the Knicks. New York City, if you're a real dude, all you guys, if you're watching basketball players, this is the city where you make your name and you get your name Mecca. up. That's right. This Mecca. is the Mecca. They call it that for a reason. Don't come on, man. Right? Yo, Jada in the building. Satchel in the building. My Knicks fans in the building. You know what I mean?